Desperate and broke, Virgil tries to support himself with small crimes. Here he attempts to rob a local pet shop. If you haven't been watching me, I'm not very good. Oh. I was, was strolling down here just now, and I noticed that you were drawing something, and I thought that I would. You can look at it if you want to. It's, can I? It's not very good. Oh. Oh, I wouldn't say that. <coughs> I think that that's wonderful. <laughs> I, I, uh... It's not very good. Well, I think that's very good, actually. I, I would have that. I think you could probably make cash. Are you, are you an artist? <laughs> No. No, of course I'm, I'm, not, I'm not an artist. No? Well, no. What, what do you do? I'm a laundress. Laundress? Mm -hmm. uh, I... Uh, laundry? Yeah, I, I wash clothes. Primarily. It's great. No, it isn't. I like it, but it's not particularly interesting. <laughs> What's your name? Louise. What's yours? Uh, uh, Virgil. Stockwell, Virgil Stockwell. What do you do? What do I do? What do I do? Um, I'm a uh, cello. Oh, that's that's fantastic. Yes, I'm a cellist. That's a wonderful job. Are you with the Philharmonic? Yes, I am actually. Oh, that's fantastic. Yes, I'm with the Philharmonic. We quite a good group. Yeah, well, I dress like this because I'm just off from work now. Say, for one. Uh, you, uh, can I just even go for a walk at all? Okay. I, uh, I know I was in love, but for first of all, I was very nauseous. You know, I, I never met such a pretty girl, and uh, I guess I'm sensitive because, you know, real, real beauty makes me want to uh, gag. Uh, plus, I, I don't know how to act with girls. You know, I'm shy, and I'm, I'm just nervous around women. I have a tendency to dribble. And, um, you know, I, the, the, the only girl that I had known was a girl in my neighborhood, and uh, it was not an attractive girl. I, and I used to used to make obscene phone calls to her, collect, and you know she used to accept the charges all the time. And nothing ever happened. And here I'm lying through my teeth. I mean, I I, I can't tell Louise that that I was in jail and that I rob and steal and never did an honest day's work in my life, because you know a lot of people hold those things against you. But she was so sweet. She, we just walked in the park, and I, I was so touched by her that. I don't know, after 15 minutes, I wanted to marry her. And after a half hour, I completely gave up the idea of snatching her purse. I wanted to tell her, actually, that I wasn't with the Philharmonic, but she was so impressed by it. And when she asked me some questions about Mozart, and she got suspicious, because uh, for a minute, you know, I couldn't place the name. I, um, I don't know, when it comes to women in, in, in prison, I remember the psychiatrist asked me if I had a girl, and I said no. And he said, well, do I think that sex is dirty? <laughs> and I, he said, it is if you're doing it right. <laughs> no, all I know is my heart was really pounding, and I felt, I felt a funny tingling all over. You know, and I, I don't know, I was either in love or uh, I had smallpox. Hey, uh, you want to have dinner tonight? Sure. Thank you. 